try, let's try something. Let's try something. Uh, I don't know. Uh, gee, what? And we'll just project. Don't worry about the throw. There you go. Whatever. If he falls, he falls. technique is uh, by our definition is fear. Any functioning of the ego tripartite mind is fear. What is fear? The functioning of the ego tripartite mind. Okay, so picking techniques is the functioning of the ego tripartite mind. It is a fear response. Okay? So instead you're going to feel the same thing you felt. So I'm going to internally let him press on me until he gives me his center, you see? And then when I want, then I'll cook you out. You understand? So I'm not gonna go. I let him press, he pushes on me. I'll feel where it is. It's right here, you feel it? Okay, and so that's the one that I use. Same thing. Hold, I wait for him to press on me. There it is right there. Then these are the two that I use. It just is smooth. Try it again. Okay, not bad, but you have, you have uh, a gaming that happens from the drill, and the drill is that the bouquet keeps pushing, okay? So as you come around like here, you see I'm not really in your center, and then you push, and then I do it. You see that? So instead, why that contact? You see? Where do you want to go? So I do that, I do, I, in your center, 
but I yield by but not coming out of your center. Okay. Oh, contact in 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 in. Look, you see. But you, I'm going to yield. But I'm in. Look. Okay, see? I'm going to go this way. Woo! Get front. Yield but in. Yield but in. Different, right? You look like this. Around the back foot. Okay, so you have this Taoist alchemical component to your training. Its main objective is to reconcile the two minds. Its main objective is a means to the spiritual maturity of the reconciled two minds. What we are going to do now in applying Kihon Waza in, inside Ji Waza, I guess it doesn't have to be a Kihon, but Nage Waza, applying Nage Waza in a Ji situation, what I'm going to do is that Taoist alchemical aspect, right, in the middle of my Nagyawaza. So, for example, I, I'm here and you can see the projection, but there's also that energetic component where I'm not just yielding. We're stuck. I just at a certain point, I boom. I'll project it out. Do you understand? Okay, so we're going to take that, the mechanism of that alchemical aspect, and that's the same thing in your keyhole. You understand? You're, like, you're not going to do something, you're not going to do something different. You're just touching different parts of that. So same thing, boom. I'm in, boom. So we'll do that tenshi nage yan. Ho, I internally let him give me his center by internally yielding. I externally yield, and now I'm adhering to his body. Then I have his body. Then I enter with his body and project the body lock. I project his body. I don't try to accelerate him. I do the same exact wrong. Focus projection on his body. Boom. So it's a lot of the technique. You know, it's the same. Boom. Or not. Okay? Any Koku projection is Koku Nagi. Okay? But any other Nagi Waza should also be Koku Nagi. Okay? Here we go.
Don't just accelerate him. There's a projection. So that same feeling should be in the kokyuho you just tried to do before. So, huh? swinging my fist through the air and getting some hip rotation and things like that, okay? So even on the techniques that look like they're momentum ones, they're not. Just like that technique that pulls you off that base, you see? Whoa, okay? So you're do I saw you do this one, you see? You're here like that, right? And it looks like you're just gonna pull this. You understand? And not. So I'll show, you, I'll show you the pulling one. Boom here. And you'll see, just we're stuck. Boom. 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 Throw. One, no, not here, here. There it is. You see that difference? Okay, so take tension on Looks like I'm going like this. But you know I'm not as the Uke. Same thing. This one looks like I'm going like this. Boom. Oh. If you know I'm not. Okay, you see the difference? Okay. Find the coque regardless of the direction. If the form itself does not count, the direction does not count. Try it again.
connection, right? You're just moving backwards. And then don't just accelerate them. You gotta ground the back foot, you gotta relax, you gotta release. You bring the you bring in the yang aspect into you, you need it to function. You can't resist it. So, uh, you know, we've been doing the Kai Tai Nang at one, we find it, but here. Okay. There, right there. So, let go of his head. You see? Don't put it all on his head and then accelerate his head. <clears throat> Even if you don't grab it, it doesn't matter. You still project up his spine. You see that? Thing? You feel like it? Yes. Okay. So how can you get there? Not important. But here's a contact point. So use it. On you. It's no different, you see? That's a contact point. You see that? So, not here. Here. Look. You see? Boom. <laughs> There's a contact point. You see? Not here. Here, you feel? Okay, and then not here. Ooh. Ooh. Contact point, project. Ooh. So just like if you were doing lower techniques, right? I don't want you. I don't want to see this external thing. Okay. Ooh. Same thing here. If you're going to practice, maybe don't complete the arm movement. Do you understand? Reduce the arm movement. Whoa. You see? Stand right here. Same thing, tension again, instead of here, maybe reduce it a little. Get it? So you can't see if they're doing it or not. Okay? Let's try it again. I mean, you can't see if they're doing it. So, um, this, that's external. And you're, I'm stronger than you. And you're just throwing it around and, you know, don't lay down on the ground too long with your back is covered. You know what I mean? Okay. Boom. 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 Boom.
That's Kazushi. All right, so what is it? The Kazushi is this. When you push and I yield until you let, basically, I'm not touching your center, but by yielding, then I have your center. That's Kazushi. So even when we're here, there we are, I am in control. You're not tilted, you see? And your line of gravity is not outside your base of support. But let's do this. You, if you go, you can let go if you want. But you didn't want to, did you? Because what did you feel? You're gonna feel that. Uh, yeah, you got it? I'm gonna punch the shit out of you. Do you understand? So what do you do instead? Yeah. I have a son. You understand? He started to let go. I don't know if you can see it, but he can feel my ill will <laughs> coming at him. He's like, no. That's Kazushi. Not the tilting. I use that to tilt you. You understand? So the tilting is an external consequence of Kazushi, which is where I touch your center by non-contesting the yang aspect of your prescribed pressure, okay? So, you're gonna do that technique, I have to do this. That's what I have, and you feel it? Again, I can move you. You wanna let go? Let go if you want, you see? So I can move you. The same thing, moving you, moving. Still here, pay attention, right? Do you want to move that arm off okay. of me? Nice. You see that? So I'm controlling you. So as you get up, I yield to that. I lift you up. But you can see that I still have that center. So I let you up. You see? And it creates openings. But it comes from controlling the center, which comes from non-contesting the yang aspect. Do you understand? Okay, so think of that as Kazushi, not the external. There is an external component, but there is an internal component that is concentric with it. Okay? If you just have the outer shell, it won't work. It's not, it's not it. Okay? Just like what I was trying to show you in this Jiyuwaza is, it really is all Kokidosa. You see, all Kihon Waza is Kokidosa. All Nage Waza, you see? So you shouldn't change it. You shouldn't get out of the way and then they fall into your hole you created or you bend them backwards and so they fall or you accelerate them and it's easier for them to just roll than try to run and get their base under them. That's not it, okay? A little bit more. 